What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Shells here. Part one of I Said What I Said series. I'm missing my boo, Devontae. We coming live to a YouTube near you. I know the girls have been waiting and gyrating for your favorite YouTube series to come on back. We'll have no more fear, bitches, because I Said What I Said series is here. That's right, we're coming back to you in July. With myself, Devontae J, and your girl, Shells, we're going to give you all the opinions, all the laughs, and all the shit in between that you didn't think you need, but we're going to give it to you anyway. So until then, I'm going to go ahead and pass it over to Coop, who's waiting for you at the Fan Fest at LA Convention Center. What's up, it's your favorite funny man comedian in Coop City, and we are in these streets at the BET Experience. Now with the BET Awards only two days away, everybody's waiting for their faves to hit the stage. But before that, we got the pre-turn up, the BET Experience. Now BET invites everybody and their mama from across the country for free concerts, fashion shows, and even basketball games. Now that I think about it, I'm missing everything. We in these streets. Come on, let's go. State your name, brother, and where you from? I'm Getty, Alabama. I'm from Montgomery, Alabama. From Montgomery, Alabama. You brought every chain from Montgomery. Boy, you look good. I got a couple of my cousins here. Uh, state your name and where you from? I'm Jay from Florida. Okay. BJ from Florida. I'm CC Media Mogul. CC Media Mogul. I like that. Are you from the Mogul or where you from? I'm from New York. Okay. New York. New York is in the building. So state you guys' name and where you from? All right, my name is Brian. I'm from Broward County, Florida. Okay, my name is Brian. Hey, brother. <laughs> hey, I'm Taylor. I'm from Michigan. From Michigan? I'm from Detroit. What's up, girl? I told y'all they was my cousins. My name is Shay, and I'm from Tulsa, Oklahoma. Oklahoma? Yeah, I didn't even know they had black people in Oklahoma. Yeah, okay. My name is Naya. I'm from Tulsa, Oklahoma as well. Oklahoma is in here thick and heavy. I like it. This is a wonderful ensemble you have on right here. I, I love it. We are back with another one of our cousins, and no, he is not really that tall, and I'm not really this short. You got to change the setting on your TV. Uh, state your name and where you from, brother. Don Diestro. I am a Los Angeles native. Okay. L.A., L.A., what up, Jeff? Who would win in a freestyle battle between Nicki Minaj and Cardi B? I'm going to have to give it to Nicki Minaj. Nicki Minaj. Quickly, Nicki Minaj, okay. Freestyle? Freestyle. Yeah, freestyle. Cardi. Cardi? Cardi would breathe. Okay. I like Cardi, but I'll say Nikki. You say Nikki? Okay, yeah. Okay. I don't know. I think the Bronx might take it over Queens, but Ooh. I don't know. Okay, so so it's two Cardi. Cardi. It's two Cardi. Cardi. I think Nikki got that one. I got Nikki. Nikki got it? Straight freestyle, I got to go with Nikki. I got to say Nikki Minaj, too. Uh. She writes her own lyrics, and her edges are immaculate. Exactly. They're immaculate. She did kill Monster. You right? She did. She did. I mean, I trust you. You have a lovely hat on, and I trust anybody that wears nice hats. Who is the hottest in the game right now, male or female? Who's the hottest in the game right now? I mean, if you want to just go by numbers and facts, you got to give it to Drake. You know what I'm saying? That's my life coach. Chris Brown. Chris. Oh, see Breezy? Yeah. Like, you was like, period, dummy. Yeah. Uh, period, poo. Like, you want to go by just who's, who's being played in the streets? It's kind of it's kind of hard to say, you know. You got you got the cats like One Take Jake, and the um, Conrad from the Av. You know, the, like the, the the LA type of popping. You know, that's not fully in the industry yet. Mmm. -hmm. Cardi. Okay. I, 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 Cardi B. Oh. Oh, do you say male? No. no. Say any, of any artist. Period. Oh, I still Chris Brown. I'm sorry. Still Chris Brown yeah. for you? Okay. Okay. As far as industry standards go, you got to give it to Drake. As far as if you had a choice, which of these would you bring back? 90s R&B, 2000s hip hop, hardcore rap, or that old Kanye? You know the one with the fucked up jawbone. Which one? 90s R&B, hands down. Easily, huh? Cause I I'm still bumping Genuine's first album. Okay. 90s R&B. 90s R&B. I knew I loved you. 90s R&B. Every time. Ooh, ooh. That, see, I see you, baby. Body roll. What about you, brother? I, I would bring. Uh. I like the new Kanye, but I bring back the old Kanye. Old Kanye, yeah. I feel like old Kanye was he was spinning a little bit hard. He had a little less money. He had to deal with all that. I like the content of the old Kanye. Yeah, he ain't had to worry about all that fake ass. You know what I'm saying? His head was just a little bit clearer. Yeah, a little bit. Who is the king of R&B? Chris Brown, Trey Songs, Usher, Tank, or Jacquees? I'm not gonna say Jacquees. Yeah, we gonna go ahead and scratch him off the list. Usher. 
Usher, are you sure you're not Jackie's in disguise trying to mingle with everybody? Are you sure? You know what? I'm gonna have to say it's in between Tank and Usher. And the reason why I say that is because Tank is an OG, but I feel like as far as impact, I gotta give it to Usher. Which of these ladies is gonna kill it on the red carpet? Her, Tiffany Haddish, Cardi B, Lizzo, or Young Miami? Lizzo. Lizzo gonna kill it? Yeah. I'm, I wanna see Young Miami. You know, from the crib. I like Young Miami. See young girl? Miami? Yeah. Cause she from, she from the crib. Yeah, okay, crib. okay, I love it. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna go with Young Miami. Okay, okay. I'm gonna have to give it to Cardi B. Okay. Cardi? Only because Cardi B goes above and beyond for everything. So okay. I feel like she's gonna make sure she looks extravagant. Not to take any credit away from those other beautiful women, but these beautiful black queens who we love and adore, we do. I just know Cardi B is gonna do that extreme do the most just to make sure she stands out what's your favorite part of the bt experience that's hosted in la what's your favorite part about this whole experience well i really love us for us by us coming together that was a lot of fun but just like the little celebrities having their own businesses here that was really cool to see like them pushing their entrepreneurship so that was really cool to see as a fan okay i like that what about you um the different celebrities you didn't know they were going to be here and you see them so that's pretty cool yeah it's pretty cool what about you bro uh, the different venues and shows they have for local artists, because I'm an artist myself from Florida. Smoke 5 Bs, check me out, iTunes, Beach Franklin on Instagram. Yeah, like, plug the yourself. Shows, the ways for uh, artists to network and shit. Okay, plug yourself, plug yourself. I love it, I love it. I love that we brings us together. Uh, we ain't had no trouble. I just smell fried chicken and uh, edge control, and I'm just super excited about it, man. Well, guys, we came, we saw, we had a ball, and we laughed. That's it for us over here at I Said What I Said with Coop in the Streets. Tune in next time. You might see somebody that you love, somebody you like. You never know. You might see your cousin. Peace out. Name the artist and the song. Hottest out, but you already know that. Even if I brought him to you, still couldn't get your boo back. I ain't finna argue with you. This ain't how we do that. Who's, who raps that? I feel like you know this. No, I don't know that. It's not a hot girl summer for you? No, I guess not. It's not? Hey, what's up? It's your favorite funny man, comedian, Coop City, and tune in this July. New episodes of I Said What I Said, the opinionated series y'all didn't ask for. We're going to give it to you anyway. And of course, catch me on my own segment, Coop on the Streets. It's going to be a scream. <laughs>